the fear of forgetting it is the number one fear in students also and in adults also the fear of forgetting is caused because of anxiety itself and when our brain is under the pressure of anxiety then we cannot think clearly because the brain's energy is so much depleted in that fear in that anxiety that it is not having a sufficient kind of energy to uh, process the normal thinking or the clear thinking that is known as brain fog especially during the examination students suffer from this brain fog and this uh, brain fog causes confusion then stress then the student feels that uh, he will forget everything in the exam and uh, blankness is there and uh, this all these uh, symptoms are temporary but still they can create a panic and have up in child's mind or student's mind or even adult's mind so what happens in the brain exactly during the fear of forgetfulness our brain is having different rhythms when our mind starts fearing then the rhythms of the brain start accelerating that means from alpha to beta from beta to hyper beta and that anxiety is created due to the hyper activity in the brain what happens due to that fear and due to that hyper activity all the resources in the brain they are totally used for the uh, purpose of that hyper activity and then our brain energy is depleted to focus on the task which is most important you understand suppose there is a particular amount of energy 10 amount of energy and out of the 10 amount of energy 8 amount of energy is going to control the fearful thoughts then only 2% energy is there which is not sufficient for the clear thinking so in order to think clearly and in order to have a less stress and to solve the problem of fear of forgetting the most important solution i am going to give you is to reduce the brain fog and to reduce the brain fog means to increase the energy in the brain to understand and think clearly how we can do that the most important thing to reduce the brain fog or to reduce this fear of forgetfulness is that becoming quiet and calm at this moment take a deep breath because deep breathing synchronizes the brain waves and brain wave synchronization reduces the fever fear then drink water drinking water also helps our brain to calm down and to improve the confidence number 4 try to start the affirmations in your mind that my memory is good and i will remember the things because that fear of forgetfulness is really unnecessary or uh, what we can say it is a uh, naughty thought or a naughty kind of a uh, suspicion in our mind because what is not reality and that mind is just imag- in imagination thinking that i will forget so there is no as such uh, remedy for that but the remedy can be mind itself with mind thought changing the thought you can tell yourself that this whatever i am thinking right now is not the truth and the truth is that my memory is intact and i should not fear deep breathing then a drinking water you can chew some peppermint tablet or you can eat some khajur or any kind of a, 
a small uh, sweet thing which will give you instantly some glucose to your brain and that energy of glucose will help your brain to focus more so my dear friends whenever you will have such a fear of forgetting do not fear kill that fear you will remember because everything is stored in the brain everything is very systematically stored in the brain the only thing is that brain needs a particular condition to remember and that condition is calmness of our brain this is because our temporal lobes are very important to retrieve the information from our memory and when we are having so much thoughts in our brain and fear our temporal lobe function is reduced and due to that we feel the confusion so for that temporal stabilization that means becoming silent internally and taking a deep breath will help you to reduce that fear and to focus on clear thinking thank you